Uh, how, wait, I'm not doing it right. All right, never mind. Yeah! That's exactly what you don't want to do when it's in gear. Slow it, slow it. Hey guys, Jessica here with Ronnie Feist. He was very kind to let us into his abode. So this is your training compound. Yeah. What, it, what made you decide to like build it here in this area and the way it's set up? Um, basically when I was like looking for a house, I just wanted to find something where I could build a freestyle park. So I kind of searched around and it kind of gets tough. Like every neighborhood has always seemed to have like horses right where the track needed to be. So like when I looked at this house, the lot next to me was empty and there was no, nothing around me. The neighbor that's closest to me didn't have horses. So I was like, I didn't even walk in the house yet. And I'm like, I'm buying it. I'm like, I just basically wanted that out there. So then we put in a freestyle course and I've, I've, you know, I've had the freestyle course probably for like five or six years. Now do a lot of the guys have the, you know, the luxury of it being in their backyard or do you let other motocross riders come over here and practice? Now a lot of guys come here, I think out here, Everyone kind of lives in Temecula Marietta area. I think me, Matto, Nate, and Deegan, and now Lynn Kogel just kind of rebuilt, rebuilt his parents' house. I think they're the only, like, the five, oh, and Potter has a spot. It's not actually at his house, it's just a, he has a chunk of land. But other than that, they're the only really spots here to ride, and all the guys just kind of rotate. And I'm kind of curious, because you did say it was pretty slick out there, well, and slick. I'm a newbie, so and, what are and you, you going to do? you get hurt every time you do something for the first time, is what I'm I hearing. always get hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Especially when the cameras are on, so. But at least I can't <laughs> whiskey it? Is that what it's called? Well, I wouldn't say you can't, because anything's possible. There's a less of a chance, because I'm going to teach you without a clutch. But you could get aggressive. You could end up in the fence. I tend to get pretty aggressive. So as much as I'm enjoying sitting by your pool, I want to get out on that track, and you teach me how to ride. All right, let's do it. We got you young. <laughs> Rockstar team out of Melissa Jersey, customized with your name on the back, so you can look professional. Thank you ever we so don't let much. Really amateurs ride out here, so we want your Lisa to look like a professional. I got squishy fat cheeks. That's all right. So, just one question: Why is my back so much smaller than yours? Your back? <laughs> my back? <laughs> well, your back's a little bit smaller than mine because I want you to walk out of here today. <laughs> if you really, really think you can handle my bike. If, as long as I can start it, right? Yeah, that's the rule. You can't start it, you can't mm -hmm. ride it. So okay, you better we're gonna be able test to... that out. Oh my God, that's really hard. <laughs> okay. Come on, dude. Like, stand up. <laughs> Ow. Fire it back. Yeah! <laughs> No. That's exactly what you don't want to do when it's in gear. <laughs> do not do that when it's in gear because it's going to just take off like a rocket, dude. Real slow with it. Slow with it. Slow with it. Slow with it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there you go. Alright, don't. Just a little bit, little bit, little bit. <laughs> little bit. Little bit, little bit. Now it's just like riding a bike. You know what I'm saying? Yup. If you gotta stop, push down on the rear brake. Got it. Down on the rear brake. Perfect. That was Can I perfect. do a ramp? You wanna go over the bump? <laughs> yeah, right. Really? Yeah. Basically, you're doing everything perfect except for shifting on your own, which is pretty simple. So whenever it revs, I, I hit like the third? You pull that up when it starts to rev out, like it's just getting kind of like making a lot of noise. And your takeoff was good the second time. Way better than the first time. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
So now you saw what I can do, I want to see what you can do. All right. If you can beat my little three humps. I will. I'll, <laughs> I'll try to see if I can one up you. I could go out in the dark and see you calling my name. I hear you shouting, you calling up not the same. Every weapon you're throwing right into my back. Doesn't matter to me, cause I'm keeping my trick. Let me go. Let me go. Thank you so much for inviting us out here. Oh, you're welcome. Now you need to get your own little personal bike. Oh, I'm 100%. Yeah. I just told him I'm going to. I love yeah, it. Yeah. I'm addicted. 110, though. You're going to upgrade even bigger, right? Okay. I will. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs>